Because you're told to leave the property I'm off and the you don't property. want to leave. Look. When entitled individuals go to a restaurant and meet someone that triggers their attitude, it often leads to a bad experience. From a woman who thought she could have her meal paid for by others. Did you call I, uh, I am recording you. Oh my god, I am recording you. I'm not even doing anything. To a man who lost his composure when a waitress began recording. I'm getting ready to slap that phone out of the I wish you would. Here are some moments when entitled Karens get arrested in restaurants. Starting with this woman whose attitude went so far that the restaurant manager had to call the police. Am I under investigation? Yep. For what? Battery. Battery. Battery of what? I have not done anything. Okay, sit there. On August 6, 2023, the officers responded to a restaurant in Florida regarding a woman causing a disturbance. The manager of the restaurant described what happened and tried to talk to the woman, but she wouldn't cooperate, so the police detained her. I'm sorry. What happened? She was screaming. I was in the office. So I come out. And she's like, oh, I know who the you are. Uh, you got a whole bunch of Spanish work in here. I said, come on. You need to sign the door. I said, be nice. You know, she worked for me like a customer. She worked like in 2014. She's like, I know you. Uh, you use Hispanics and all this. I said, look, it's time for you to go. Hang up the phone. He said that I can hang up. Yeah, it's, is that dispatch? I, I don't, sir, I is don't this, know. It's Officer Wishart. Thank you. Right. You don't talk, I'm the police. They're just oh. dispatch. What, what do you need? Can I get that phone, yeah, please? What do you need? Can I get that phone, please? Yeah. What do you need? Ma'am? She's gone. Do not call 911 again. Ma'am? Do not call 911. Ma'am? Do not call 911 again. Can you hear me? Did you call 911? I, I am recording you. Oh my God, I am recording you. I'm, I'm not even doing anything. Stop. I'm not even doing anything. I'm recording you. Huh? I'm not recording. No, she's being uncooperative. Why? We're taking the from what he said earlier. Yeah. We're investigating better. I'm not. You're detained. You're not under arrest for the. Am I under arrest? Listen, listen, so can I listen, go? Listen, listen can I go? No. Stop Am yelling. I under arrest? Are you going to listen to me? Am I under arrest? You're detained. I'm detained for what reason? The purpose of our investigation. What investigation? Well, I'll tell you that in just a minute. No. No, 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 Am I under investigation? Yep. For what? Battery. Battery. Battery of what? I have not Sit done down. anything. Okay. Sit down. Sit in the car. Up in the chair. No, you said sit. No, you said chair. sit. No, in no, no, no. no. Hey, you said sit. Back. Nope. You said sit. You're gonna go to jail nope. if you don't sit. That's car. fine. You said sit. You said sit. You said sit. You said sit right here. Nope. You said sit right here. Nope. You said sit right here. Well, I'm telling you something different now. Sit in the chair. No. 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 Under my. So you're refusing to cooperate? Yes. Okay. Good. Now you can go to jail. No. I'm not going to jail. I haven't done anything. I haven't. Sir, I have not done anything. You cannot take me to jail. The managers then explained where the altercation began and spoke with some employees to hear their statements. Where about to happen? Where? Right there. Where they're sitting? Yeah. Okay. And so what she said to you? Uh, she just was, I was in my office. Yep. She was in here screaming. He comes and gets me. Who comes and get you? The band of red. I said, this girl's just going off, screaming at everybody, going off on everybody. I come out of the office and I said, hey, what's going on? Anybody do anything to you? And she's like, F you. There's one, two, three, four. She just starts oh, coming. He got you. Yes. Or, or a worker. Yeah, the assistant manager. He came and got you. Yeah, he came and got me, and then she just counting everybody. And you're a piece of. Shit. And she's telling him, the guy that's there, he just calm. And she's just, I don't know what the uh, discussion was, but he's with her, so he could tell you more of what got happened. It. He's with okay. her literally. Though. Came out of the office because she was counting everybody. Yelling, right. and and I, and I, yes. Okay. And I, I said, uh, "What's wrong with you? Come on, come on, let's go talk." They opened the door. Right? Come on, I said, "Come on outside." And then she was come, like coming, and then she turned around. No, I'm not going outside. I'm staying here. I said, "We're going to go close it. We're going to clean it up." I said, "Hey, I'm you." And I go over there. Is just, did somebody do anything to you? So you walk in there to her where she was yeah, saying. Yeah. She, she went back and sat okay. down, and she got up and just poosh. 
Do you have any oh. injuries? No, okay. no, 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 but it was just the, the, the thing. She Are you looking to press it. charges? Yeah, I want her. Out of you want her trespass or press charges? I was press charges. Okay. okay. Uh, could you talk to her? Yes, the, I will. The current... Let me get your information. Okay. You recorded it? Well, this camera, but she was here since 4.30 and time to She was here since 4.30 Okay. And she's been drinking. Oh, yeah. He pays. He, he pays. Oh, you pay her. Yeah. yeah, but oh, I Are you with her? Yeah. They're, they're oh, okay. yeah. talking. Yeah. The bill paid. Fine. They're, 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 they're happy. I don't know what happened. And I bring the bill. Yeah. Just pure alcohol. And when I bring the beer, so, I don't know what happened. She I was in the office. Screaming. He came and got me. So I guess he's a witness. Because okay. he's like, there's a lady out here. She's snapping. Because he told him it's time to get the clothing. Okay. And he's like, he's like, yeah. No, but he's, he's been a very gentleman. Yeah. Thank you. He's very super gentleman. He, he just, he's been gentleman. He never even got involved. So yeah, in contrary, he was telling her, calm down, calm down. And the weather. And the rain, the weather bring the bill. She said, like, make no sense, but she was here since 4 30. And go, oh, just out the whole day, just order one food. And the whole night, we were drinking and drinking, and we closed. And so uh, I told her what a nice we talked to her, and uh, we closed, and uh, no more, we can sell more alcohol. And she got upset about that. Because she couldn't be served anymore? Because uh, she want more drinks, and we said, like, mm -hmm. you're not. She said, yeah, we don't. And then what happened? And then she started grieving all over the wrong, say, oh, my weather, so my employees that fuck all day. And we all stand, and she's on the block, and then um, or I, I go grab my boss, and I got a situation, and she started yelling to him, um, and then she uh, put like face to face to him, and push him back. How, how did she push him? Like, he, she like super close, okay. get super close to him, then she like... Like with one hand? <laughs> no, like... I, I didn't see right away because I was in the side, but I think it's, I think it's one, only one hand. Okay. Are you, are you to pull cameras for me? Uh, yes. yes. Real quick, if you can do it real quick. Be nice to see. Uh, no, no, no. You, you, I'll give it to you. Can I go inside? Yep, thank you. Yeah, thank it. you, man. The problem is, the one that handles the one in there, she's not here during the day. I got where you can see. You just got to go back. Yeah. Are you going to go back? Yeah. What do you I don't, I, I, don't, I don't understand the, the girl. I mean, she's just like, raging out. Like, she was super fine. She was singing karaoke. Like, that's the problem with this one. Is While taking the woman to the station, she began hitting the cruiser door, prompting the officer to stop and warn her. Stop, stop kicking my door! Stop! Stop! No! You're gonna tell me! She's kicking her window out. When did I resist? When? 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 When did I resist? When did I resist? Take me to county jail. Take me. And then to stop county kicking my door. Stop. Take me. No. No. I'm no, going no, to the jail. No. If you stop. Take me to county prison. No. Okay. Good. Take me uh, to a county right now. Deal. That's what I'm doing. Take me to county jail. All right. When Stop kicking I the window. Go? When did I go to jail? When? 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 When?
The woman was charged with battery and resisting. Watch the drama this woman made just to get out of paying her meal bill. You said you're not gonna pay this? No, I am gonna pay it tomorrow. Okay, well, that's gonna help me. All right, come on, get his money back. Really? Yeah. On April 4th, 2024, an officer responded to a call regarding a woman refusing to pay for her pizza. The cop approached the woman and inquired about settling the bill, but she made things more complicated. Good. That's, did we get this figured out? No. Okay. If I need my boyfriend to um, pay my bill, and there, and what happened was my other phone, my phone doesn't have Wi-Fi in there. Let's take this outside. Sorry. Uh, I just, yeah, I my dad did 44 years in the NYPD. That's right. You can call him. That doesn't matter. It does matter. I had money in my account, okay. and Talk now I him. don't. He's in charge here. Okay, I had money in my account, and now I don't. Okay. This right. happens to me all the time. My car broke down. You're, you're like, you can okay. see it. Well, you need to pay your bill. I know. I'm going to make money if I have my phone to make money. Well, you need to pay your bill now. Okay, you have to take me to jail. Okay. So you're not going to pay your bill? No, I'm going to pay my bill if I have my phone. I Are you going to pay your bill it. right now? I'm going to try. Where's your phone? In the bar. Okay, Probably in my bag where sometimes it vanishes because God just does that to me. I'm confused. How are you going to pay your bill with your phone? I'm going to ask people on Facebook to pay my bill. Morgan Wallen. No. Yeah, he does gonna... He does do that. We're not going to sit here and do yeah. that. Well, we'll Correa, we can. Wait out here for you. Okay. Do you have a driver's license? Yes, I do. Where's that? In there. All right. So, you... I had money in my cap. Are we going to pay the bill today? I want to. Not with... Asking Morgan Wallen. <laughs> okay, my dad. Uh, your dad means nothing to me. To be I, completely honest, he means nothing. I know, NYPD cops hate you guys too. That's fine. I, it doesn't matter that he's NYPD or not. Your dad is not anywhere. My mom can pay my bill. If we, I went to her house to try to get it. Okay, is your mom willing to come here and pay your bill right now? Yes, if you call her. Okay. If you call her, she's not going to believe me. She thinks I'm a psycho. She's stealing my kids from me. We can trauma bond all day long, but we're not going to do that. Okay. Is this your vehicle? Yes. Okay. All right. Are you a registered owner of the vehicle? Yes, I am. You don't have anything inside this vehicle to pay your bill? No, I have $7 on to pay my bill. Pop 315 St. John's. My boyfriend's come and pay it for me. He will do that, but I need a phone to do that. Then the employee explained the situation. However, the woman gave a lot of excuses about paying the bill, but nothing seemed promising, so she was arrested. She's sitting here trying to come up with all this stuff about how she wants to try to get the money, so we're not willing to well, she that. wanted to offer that. Yeah. She didn't have a car that she could find. She, yeah, she, she walked here. Like, she walked in here with no car, and then she drove off in that marine car, so it must, someone had to drop, like, I was like, either she's a magician, <laughs> she's a movie star that's just trying to cause trouble for PR. Like, I don't know what, I just can't read it all, and I'm like, you know, I gotta... Larry will pay my bill. Larry? Who's Larry? Larry, my ex-boyfriend. All my ex-boyfriends are friends of mine. They'll pay my bill. They, they have jobs. But I need my phone to work to call them, and my phone is dead. I can go to my house and charge it. Uh, do you guys want to press charges? Uh, she can't pay her bill. I can walk there and leave my car here and my bag here. Okay. You leave your bag here? You stay here often? Or I'm a where... squatter. Okay. All right. Where is your residence right now? Right there, 130. Which car did you come here? In, in the red car. Let's go use it. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. You said you're not going to pay this? No, I am going to pay it tomorrow. Okay, well, that's not going to help me. All right, come on, give me his money back. Really? Yeah. Like, you want to call in prison? You do. You're going to jail right now for defrauding an innkeeper. I did it before. You're failing to pay your bill. I'm not failing to pay my bill. I need my bag so I can make some phone calls. Get your bag. And my pizza and my meal. No, you're not taking that. Hit first. They don't take food in jail. Oh, Ballard, I have Brendan Wood, right? Daniel Rowe. Right. 27.9 here. You're ready. Now I'm not going to get my kids 26, back. thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh that would have been bad. 
Do you have anything on you that's going to go yes, into the I tomb? Yes, I have a knife! St. John's. My... Okay. You should get my bag so I can call my dad. <gasps> you can be my bill. Oh, yeah. She's going to be 10, 15 my friend's still Or my mom. I'm not a defrauder. This shit happens to me all the time. You're all your friends know me. So you said you have a, a knife up your Yes, I do. You want to come get it? No. I, I didn't think so. Okay. Thanks. So you know. Appreciate it. Yeah. Holy cow. Yeah, there's some more Brody for you. No, well, there's a bunch in here. Did she buy that one from you guys? Well, yes. Yeah. She bought well, it. Well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then she brought these? Yeah, those were in there. Gotcha. Thanks, Austin. Yeah, not appreciate a problem, guys. Y'all have a good one. I appreciate you. No, for real. We were just, as we pulled up, where he, he said, he's in training, he said, have you been here? I said, no, not yet. I need to come check it out. Well, so. if, you guys, if you guys have a break a little bit later, your no, pizza's no, on no, me, okay? Cool. Pop at 263 St. John's. Okay. Is there a female deputy that can be 51 to us by chance? She's saying she has a signal zero in an inappropriate place. The police spoke with the woman's mother, who mentioned a similar incident happened the previous night. It turned out this behavior was common for her. Should you oh, you look so pretty. Thank you. I was going to my boyfriend's house, but he, I didn't want to so pretty to go to her. Well, I, I was at the pub waiting for him to come get me. Real quick. Come on out, Clark. Gonna, you said you got some up there? No, I don't. I was kidding. Well, okay. Not well, something to joke about. I gotta kind of check. Really? Not gonna, yeah, not gonna, yeah, I'm not gonna do a whole. Um, I was hey, kidding. Before she does that, let me ask you. I just talked to your mom on the phone and she said that you didn't pay your bill at some bar last night. No, because this happens to me all the time. Well, if you didn't have money to pay I your bill last money. night, I did have money. I have $7.5 million. Okay. All, right. all right. He's just, he asked He's being an. No, he's asking you a question. This is my dad did 44 years in the NYPD. I did 20 years in the NYPD. Okay, so I'm retired. No, you're not. Do you have anything up your hoo ha? No. God, I don't want to look. I know. I, I, don't, I don't. I gonna, don't. I'm going to check I, it. I can't. So, I, 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 just at least do a pat down. Step like, out. I, I can't. Vehicle. A thing because my legs are stuck because they're chubby. You're athletic. You're not chubby. And don't call us chubby, woman. All right, just put your stomach up there. Your dress is so cute. Yeah, thank you. All right. I need my bag. I need it. Go ahead. We're going to get it. Wait, go. The woman was charged with defrauding an innkeeper. Take a look at how this woman and her husband made a big mess over a simple issue. But the twist came when they each told different stories. So the girl sit up right here. She sits up, comes from behind the girl, and throw a whole extra large cup in her face. On September 9th, 2023, deputies were sent to Burger King after Shri Ross threw a cup at an employee because her food was served late. When the police arrived at Burger King, he saw that a female employee looked quite shocked. So he spoke with her to find out what had happened. Hello, is everyone okay? We were actually behind oh, the car. Right we were behind the car. Was it in the driveway? Yeah. 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 He came in here, he... They just, they just start acting crazy, these people. And she, she's, I'm so, like, it's okay, okay. just gotta take a deep breath. We were behind the car. And Is it, are I, you injured at all? He hit me in my thing with this thing right there. They threw this napkin thing at me. They threw trays at me. Were they back here? No, they were no, right here. No, they were right here. They took these trays off and they threw them at her. They threw drinks in the door. Okay. They hit another lady back there, too. We'll figure it out. We have, uh, I, I told the other people to go look for them, so we got the plate from you guys. Do uh, you want to sit down somewhere so we can I talk? the kids' meal and two double cheeseburgers. You guys too happy? Yeah. Yeah, we were trying to the car, and I've seen them, like, walk through the window, and I was like... Do you guys have a minute after I'm done speaking yeah. with her? Would you mind to speak with her? Yeah, before? absolutely. Thank you. you want to see? You don't need the fire department to come check you out? Was he mad about? 
So the girl asked me for a four piece nugget. She asked for a value nugget and I said that's the four piece nugget. She was like, why do I want to pay four dollars and something for a four piece nugget when I can get an eight piece nugget for uh, the, the thing? I said, I was just bringing up what you said, which was the value nugget. And so she was like, never mind, I'm going to come up there with my order. I get up. Whatever it is that they had, this is his cup too. Whatever it is that they had in their hand, they took it and threw it in. They threw sanitizer at us. They threw sanitizer at us. Give me a minute, please. And then she threw that, she threw her drink at me. I threw her drink back at her. And she had both in the drive through and in here. So she comes around, she gets out her car. She, they're like, come on, let's fight, let's fight, let's fight. I'm like, girl, I'm not about to fight you over some nuggets. You can get out of here with that. Take your, take your mess out of here. I was like, come on, let's fight, let's do this, let's do this. Next thing you know, some man came in here in a whole different car. And they just all just start throwing stuff at me, throwing this at me. Three people total? Three people total. Two black girls and a black guy. You're okay, are you okay? Let's go. You shouldn't have to be treated like that. So they were just mad because you said it was a four piece? Yes, they got that angry over a four piece nugget. Like, I thought it was over with. They was like, when she asked me to come to the window, I didn't realize it was for me to be getting a drink thrown in my face. Whatever it is that they threw in my face. Did they say anything while they were in your trash in the place? Yeah, they were trying to get me to come out here and fight. Okay, besides, besides that, what they were saying, like, they were just saying fight us or something like that? Yes, and they and I went come around the corner. They was like, just start taking stuff and just find the stuff to throw and just throw it and throw it and throw it. Okay. I just lost the black and black and glass box with my hand and it broke on my hand. Are you injured? I mean, it's okay. It's just okay. Let the really red mark on the side. Okay. I am fine. You guys, were you, you guys were in the drive-thru when this happened? Yeah, yeah, we were right behind Yeah, we were behind us. Yeah, so basically what I saw happen, um, when they pulled it, they pulled up, and then they like put around the corner, backed up, pulled forward, backed up, pulled forward, that thought was weird. Then they got up to the window, we were looking down, we looked up and watched them throw a drink at the window. Yeah. Then they closed it. Which I car? think they threw it first. It was the driver. Yeah. Which car was it? It was the Kia. It was the Kia. Okay. It was the Kia. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So they threw something in the window, they closed the window, and they threw something else and slacked off the window and back on the bed. And then I heard them pull around. I thought they left. Yeah, we thought they left. And then and I heard, heard yelling. yelling from the side. Yeah, because we were up at the window, we paid, and then we heard yelling. You guys were in the tractor when you heard the yelling? Yeah. And then they came back and told us that they'd come inside and started throwing stuff. Yeah, well that's what he had asked me to say. So what did the police told you? Yeah, they could be told me. Okay. Yeah, well, that's what he was sitting there, and then he told, he told me, he was like, did they come back inside? And I said, they're listening for a minute. You can hear them slamming stuff around you. Um, did you guys come in here and see any damn stuff that happened while they were here? No, no. we came in here, guys. Yeah. Okay. All right. The cop then spoke with another employee who had been injured by Cherie during the altercation. Are you the shift manager? I'm the store manager. Okay. Alright, so you'll be a representative for Burger King as well? Yeah. Okay, since Burger King won an Asian prostitution for family conduct. Okay, that works. What was your address, sir? Uh, yeah, my mom. Oh, okay. How do you get home? Um, my grandma. She yeah, she comes over here because my mom isn't here at the moment. She's in Colorado working for Coca Cola. Oh, nice. Yeah. Can I see your hand? Where'd they hit you? Right there? That red line? Yep. Yeah. picture hand, okay? Oh, okay. What got thrown at you? Someone from back here? It was, you know, you know the glass box of cookies that they usually have here? Uh, oh, yeah. They threw that at me. The display one? Yeah, and it broke on my hand. Wow. That's glass, you said? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, which one threw it at you? Do you remember? It was the guy. Yeah. yeah. Did he 
when he threw it, did he say anything to you? No, it's like, when I, it came over here, he just, I, I didn't know where he came from. He wasn't with them when I, when I was out there talking to them about the whole situation. I come in here because I was, I, was I was out there getting their license plate, and they were talking to me about how they should like, get the manager out here because and make her clock out so I'm going to kick her ass or to fight her. They said that to you? Yeah. And they told her, like, there's, there's no reason why there's, that she should be talking to us like that. Even though they asked for four piece, eight piece, and another four piece of value. Uh, so when you guys get the orders over the intercom, everyone's able to hear what's being said, right? Yeah, everyone who has the headsets on will be able to hear. So what, did you hear what was said between them? Yes. Uh, now the manager was just said that, well, you ordered the four piece, but since you're saying the eight piece, we'll do that for you. And I guess they took that as disrespect. And before we ever get their other orders, they just drove in. And then since we were busy, the line was slow. And they also got aggravated because of that. They, and then they pull up, and I see the I see the shift, I see the store manager go up, talk to them, and then I look I go this way, and I look back, and there's. The, but there's a cup being thrown at her. Okay, I'm working on it. And I don't know what the so I don't know what it is. I think it might have been sud or some type of liquid. But it was all it's all over that window. Okay. And then they pull the up cup. here. I don't know. I couldn't see. Okay. Did you see who threw this one? That one? Okay. And the yellow one? It was like a dicky's cup. I it was it was either one of the it was either one of those women okay. over that. But the guy was mainly the one who threw the sanitizer, threw the glass box, threw the trays. Okay, and then I'm still waiting for photos for him, so we'll figure out what he looks like. Uh, He's a tall, tall black dude. He had a gray, sh he had a gray shirt, he had a, a black, like, uh, a cooking wear, and he also had a hat on. Like a baseball hat? No, it was like one of these, where it was like, it was a like a work, yeah, it was like a visor. Is it cooking work? Like, it would yeah, like, he looks like he just came out of cooking something. Like from Dickies? Probably. I think if he works at fast food, he would treat you guys like this. Meanwhile, Cherie spoke with an officer by the road and wanted to share what happened at Burger King. Surprisingly, Ross gave a completely different story, claiming she wasn't the aggressor. Uh, Hi. My mom was trying to talk to you. Okay. I'm trying to, I just saw you sitting there and I want to turn around because I was actually getting ready to call the police. Um, so the it, incident at, at Burger yes, King? and I want to tell you, like, I am just left the grocery store. I got groceries in my okay. car. Can I, I mean, come on the other side okay, and I'll talk to you on that fine. side. Okay, that's fine. So, this. So, I left the grocery store. I stopped at Burger King to get my kids some nuggets. Uh -huh. So, I'm in the drive-thru and I asked for nuggets. The lady on the intercom with an attitude, that's not what you said. You said it, so they left us sitting in the drive-thru forever. So I'm like, I got to the window, I was like, just cancel my order, I don't want it no more, because you rude, you in customer service, you don't talk to people like that. Mm -hmm. And see, look, I don't got time for this. She threw a whole, you see all this pop all over my car, she threw pop inside of my car, wet my daughter up, wet my young kids in the back seat. So I got upset and I was like, no, you are not going to do that. So I pulled into the front. The young guy came out saying he the manager. I was like, so you let your workers do stuff like this, just throw pop and expect nobody not to do nothing back? I was like, no, that's not how it works. I was like, I'm calling the police. I said, I'm reporting y'all. I was like, and I'll mess around and beat this lady. I'm not going to lie. I did say that. And so he was like, she didn't do anything. I said, how she didn't do nothing? And you see all this pop on my car. Mm -hmm. So I go in there and she, um, I, all right, I got something for you. I said, I got something for you too. I was like, come from around the corner, around the counter or whatever. So I'm like, she never came from around the counter just talking mess. Another customer seen her do something and like, I think threw some water or some crap on her, but she crazy. Like that lady is crazy and I'm trying to, yeah, my son is like throwing up. So I'm trying to get him, we just want to get him a Sprite and something to eat. Uh -huh. And so I'm sitting up here trying to call corporate like 99 times and they not even answering so I can report this location. But I don't appreciate that crap. And she, well, I'm calling the police. Call them because when I get to home, I'm calling them too. And that's what made me turn around because I saw you sitting there. Uh -huh. So, but I don't know. Like, I just, something got to be done. That's not fair. Like, that's just not right to me. Okay. You guys got your IDs on you? I do.
I'm shaking, I'm all upset, like, what the heck? Sorry, I just had my ID out, so I gave it to the insurance. No problem. Three, I got one of yours. She don't have her purse. Okay. Oh, that's an old ID. Well, it still shows me for her. Here, give them some water. Was there, um, was there an incident, did you, like, your husband or something go in the store as well, or? I don't know who came in. I was so no. upset, honestly. I just, like, I was yelling at this lady, and I pulled off and turned off the, down the side by uh -huh. the, what is that, Planet Fitness. Okay. Because they were saying your Suburban was there as well. My husband is at work. At work? Yeah. Okay, so he wasn't there at all with the Suburban? My husband is at work. He works at Dick. He's at work. He's the only one there at the store. Okay. All right, just stand by for me. Okay. The law enforcer returned to Cherie to get more details, and she admitted that she had called her husband but left before he arrived. All right, ma'am, can you just run by me one more time? What, what happened? Mm -hmm. So we went to the drive thru and I ordered a steak, and I have a chicken sandwich, number nine, and I was like, and the value nuggets. Mm -hmm. So I was on the on the first on the intercom, it was a, I think it was a guy I was talking with. He was fine, nice. Then they seen, you know, this girl get on there, and she was like, um, she was she like, I have nuggets. two nuggets. Yeah, she was like, the nuggets. eight piece. She was like, that's not what you said. That's not what you said. Okay, well, why would I buy? And we was like, well, why would I pay $5 for four nuggets and you could get uh, eight for two something? But that's not what you said. This was attitude. So we was like, okay, you know what? Forget it. Never mind. So it was a car in front of us. So we sat in the drive through waiting on the car to go. And we was going to go ahead and leave, not even mm -hmm. get the food. So I pulled, as the window came, it was a white girl came to the window. And I told her what happened. She was like, did y'all have blah, blah, blah. I was like, no, I'm just canceling my order. I was like, the lady, the black girl that was on the intercom was rude as I was like, where is she? I was like, because she needs to get reported. And she came to the window. Don't nobody got time for this, just talking mess. And she threw a cup of pop in the in the car at us, like a big orange cup of pop. So I was like, okay, pull around. I was like, no, you're not going to throw pop on my kids. So that's how the whole thing started. Like, she shouldn't have never did that. And then that. I'm sitting up trying to tell the little young guy come out talking about he the manager. How you the manager, but you allowing her to treat your customers like this. Mm -hmm. So I was like, I'm reporting you, her, and this whole store. Now, I've been on the phone trying to call the corporate for Burger King, but I can't get through to nobody. Okay. Do you have, what kind of cup did they throw at you? Do you have the cup, or was it just uh, a... No, it's probably in the drive through It was a paper cup. Like, it, it was white. Yeah, it was a white cup, and it hit the window. It came in the car, and then I think it bounced out in the drive through Probably okay. in the drive -thru. everywhere. Okay, so when you went inside, what happened when you went inside? When I went inside, we was yelling, and I told her, I was like, you don't, uh, you don't treat people like that. You come from around the corner. I told her, I was like, I'm about to beat your ass. That's what I did tell her that. You, I got something for you. So she got on her phone and started dialing something. I was like, I don't care. I was like, I'm not from here, but you're not going to sit up and disrespect me like that. And then she suddenly just talking from behind the corner. We threw some stuff over the, uh, the napkin holder and all of that crap over the counter. And she still didn't come out. And I was just like, okay, whatever. But nobody came from behind the counter. We were fighting from over the counter. Over the counter? Yes. And you threw a napkin holder? Yep. Earlier. No one's hands touched. Nobody's hands touched nobody. But I ain't gonna lie, I did knock all the <laughs> counters. Knocked all the <laughs> counter? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then you threw a napkin holder? Yeah. Okay, did you throw anything then? No, no, she did. No. She was standing next to the, uh, like next to the counter. I thought the girl was gonna try to grab her, her honestly. Okay. Just telling her how wrong she was to pop on That ain't gonna fly. Okay. So then they're also saying there was a guy, a male in a suburban, that was there too. I did. I called my husband and told them what he did, but I don't even know. I was so upset. I really don't even know if he came. Like I got, I was just mad. I'm not gonna even lie to you. Okay. So he didn't come there while you were there. I don't think so. Okay. And you say he's at work? Yeah, he's at work. Where does he work at? Um, at the restaurant across the street, Dickies. Dickies? Yeah. Okay. While listening to Cherie's long story, the cop instructed her to step out of the vehicle, asked if her daughter could look after the young children, and then proceeded to detain her. But Can he, I have you step out of the car yeah. with me? So I'll just come back and talk about my truck, okay? Okay. How are you? Good. 
So you you were saying? Huh? You were saying? I said my husband came up there, uh, but he came up there and he saw the dude taking pictures of the car and my kids was crying. And he came in there and told us to leave, basically. He was like, y'all get the up out the store and just leave. I didn't say nothing because I didn't want him to get in trouble because he did leave his job without nobody else being at work. But he said that he told his boss that he left. What was your daughter told? Just yelling, basically. Yeah. Yep, <laughs> just yelling. Guys because she threw the pop, like she threw it and it went all on my kids and I got mad. Like really, that's the only reason I even went in there. I'm like, that was just unacceptable to me. And then I went in there to really file a complaint with the manager, but then they just automatically was rude. And it just, like I got triggered, I'm not gonna even lie. Like I feel bad, but it was just like, you don't do that to people. Did you throw the nuggets at the person I didn't first? even get food. I didn't yeah. get anything. I told them, no. I said, I don't want my order. I don't want nothing. And she threw, you. yeah, she threw a big, like, big ass cup of orange pop. It's all over yeah, my car. I see that. Yeah. You know, my partner was saying on the video, like, you throw something at them first. I did throw some water. You do some water? Yeah. That's what I'm trying to do. Oh. Hear. I don't know why they throw some water. It didn't hit her, though. It did not hit her. Yeah, it didn't hit nobody. Okay. Where's your husband at? He's at work. Where's he working? At Dickies. He's the manager oh. over at Dickies. Those are all your kids? Yep. But she's an adult? Yeah, she's an adult. She's a nurse. She's uh, 29. Okay, she had a handy place under arrest. Okay. Nice and cooperative. Don't put two on you, okay? I'm going to mess up your watch either. Let me lock these up first so I don't lock them more, okay? I, no, they didn't. Okay. You want your phone, you said? Um, it's alright. If I can't talk on it, there ain't no point in having a torch on that. <laughs> Anything on you, right? Nothing? No, no, Nothing? No. Okay. The police went to Cherie's husband, Tavares' workplace, to question him, but his information did not match what Cherie had said. How you doing, sir? Do you mind coming out here, please? Are you Tavares? Yes, sir. Okay, do you know why we're over here today? About what? My wife got arrested? Yeah. About the lady threw the pop on and stuff? Yeah. And no more kids. Yeah, so what, you know what happened? Yeah, told, I'm on the phone. My daughter just told me about it. Okay. Were you involved at all? You got no way. I got a, a call, crowd of call, y'all. My son got to throwing up. I did go, I'm not gonna lie to you. My son throwing up. The car, man, my daughter was in the back seat. Wet as hell. Just pop all over the car, bro. Okay. I'm on the phone. I'm the supervisor. So I'm on the phone, I'm listening to everything. I'm telling them, like chill, chill out. I even talked to the to the lady, the black lady. She swore she was the supervisor. She wasn't the supervisor. I ain't gonna even lie. I threw, I, they threw something at my wife. I threw something. You should have seen my son. I don't know. If, I don't know which one of y'all was there. Man, my son was in the. His whole face was red, throwing up, bro. They threw a whole. I don't know what that was. She threw in his face. He was in the back seat. He five, he's four. I apologize for cussing and throwing okay. up. He's four years old, bro. Okay. My daughter's only twelve. She didn't have no reason to cuss my cuss my wife out. I don't care what was going on. My wife was wrong and she was wrong. They had no point to afford to even escalate as far as it did. But she didn't have no reason for. She sent the girl to the window. It should have been dead from there. I thought. So the girl right. Oh, I, my fault. My fault. So the girl. I ain't, I'm not. I'm not on that man. So the girl set up right here. She sits up, comes from behind the girl, and throw a whole extra large cup in her face. Not my wife. She threw it in my daughter. That was my daughter drive. That was my baby in the back. See, four years old. He's seizure prone. Okay. 
So no one threw some, no one threw anything out of your guys' car first? No! I swear to God, no, go look at the camera. I swear Which to God. Which car were you in? Huh? Which car were you in? Which car was I in? Yeah. What you mean? What, what car were you car driving? Huh? What car you were in a car, right? I was in a truck. Which truck? What kind of truck were you in? Oh, a black truck. Is it a bourbon or a truck? It's a truck. What you mean? Like I don't Ford F one fifty or what is it? No, it's a suburb. Okay. What you mean, uh So someone throws water on you. No, it wasn't no water, it was popped. It stuck all okay, in the so top. I don't even know what it was. I'm just assuming. How do we get to the point where someone's having a glass cookie thing shattered on them? Nobody had no glass cookie thing shattered on them, bro. Did y'all did y'all look at the cameras? Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody throw no glass cookie thing shattered on nobody. How do all the stuff on the counters end up on the I pushed it on the floor. I'm not gonna lie to you. I pushed it on the floor. I swear to God I did. I didn't throw nothing at nobody. I didn't throw nothing at nobody. You can go look at the cameras if I'm, I'm telling you to look at the camera. I didn't throw nothing on nobody. Okay. All I'm saying, I'm a man, man. I think you came by my, you pulled me over the other day. Like, cause of, cause of my plate thing. Cause I had the paper plates up. That's not me. Oh, it's all right. I, no, I don't. But bro, what I supposed to do? Cause no, neither one of y'all do the same thing. Y'all got four years old. She didn't have no reason to do what she did. As a worker for a company to come behind. If you sent somebody else to handle the situation, why would you come from behind your worker to throw a hole? I don't know what it was. I'm, I'm not. assuming it was lit. Why didn't you call us? I, I did. I did. So I'm not saying what the other person did was wrong or what was right. Okay, but I talked to your wife. She told me she threw water at her first. I didn't know that. Okay. Huh? What you, you talk, wait, wait. Who? Your wife threw water at the lady first. No, she didn't. That's what she told me. Why would I lie to you? I'm not lying to you. Your wife is very nice. I ain't disrespect you. I'm not. I'm no, I'm not, not saying that. No, but no, she no, did. No, so no. she's like, I did. I was upset. I threw. I threw water at her, and then she threw the soda, and it hit your kids. That's what she was telling us. So that's kind of how it started. She said she was upset. So if you didn't see that, that's fine. It's not a big deal. You telling me my wife threw something first? Yes, sir. I'm, and I'm, being, I'm not. I'm not being. A I Lying to you, sir. I'm being straight yeah, up I, and down with you. I appreciate you. No, that's what she told me. Yes. And I know. I see you not lying, bro. And I. I feel. Up right now, cause man, I didn't get what I didn't get what you got. She Fair didn't enough. give me that story. Yeah, All I heard was crying in my and I, and I pull up in my. Did baby. you come up after the fact? Huh? Did you come up after the I fact? I was on Facetime with her. Okay. So. All this time she's telling me I So can't. she's in the drive thru while you're on FaceTime. Yes. She's okay. sitting on the passenger and side. So, my daughter driving. Right. She's like, man, I like she cussing me out. I like, look, just chill out. I told her to leave. Okay. She's like, I can't leave because they got they doing the same thing to the man in front of me. Okay. They got me blocked in. I called over there. I talked to a manager. And I and it wasn't even a manager, it was just, it was some somebody else. I said, ma'am, could you please tell him to Whoever was ever going on, you can ask them. Could you tell them to clear up the line so that people can get out with I said, my baby in the back seat is hot and he's sick. Can yeah. you please let him get past? Mm -hmm. And she said, Harry, let that man get his stuff so they can get it gone. Uh, after that, the phone went dead. Okay. And that's when all the, the commotion. And that's when you went over there. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough, right? Yeah, to yeah, check fair. on him. Yeah. Okay, and then you guys and I all got, I pulled up the little black dude sitting he literally sitting on the car. On your car or her car? On my daughter's car. Okay. Taking pictures, screenshots with itself, like it's a game. Like I everybody living for social media yeah. and world star, dog. We know. <laughs> we deal with it every day. Like, I'm 43 years old. I promise. I went to school. I got my I got my bachelor's in digital forensic science. I got my associates in criminal justice. Man, I don't want to have no breakdown. Man, I'm just tired of that social media, shit, man. Cause that was social media bullshit, man. I'm tired of that, shit, man. It's a time and place for. Shit. And I apologize for cussing, but stupidness for every English can be fixed, man. So even, you, even your wife is saying, like, you guys going in there just took it too far, right? You guys probably shouldn't have went in there. And that's I'm where the mistake the is. I the restaurant, and I'll tell you I was wrong. Well, that's the thing. If they came in here, yeah, and started destroying your restaurant, right? Like, it's the same thing, right? So I was wrong. I'm not going to even lie to you. I got, I and I appreciate wrong. that. And that's, that's where we're at, man. Do you know what I'm saying? I was wrong, so. bro. And I ran out of She didn't tell me to shit. This. Fair enough, All dude. I got was FaceTime up and... All out of the screaming commotion in my babies, man. Since Tavares' story didn't add up, he was arrested. We have the key so we can lock it up, Abel? Okay. That's it. I gotta turn it off too before it catch on fire. Yeah. 
Anything else, man? Oh, you know, I'm pulling this right here. That uh, oil thing. Unplug it? Yeah, It's unplugged already. Uh, at the top right there. So, uh, down there, Cherie was charged with five counts of disorderly conduct and damage to property. Tavares was charged with assault, damage to property, and disorderly conduct. When an argument upset this woman, it turned into a legal problem after she took things too far. Really, it wasn't bad, man. It wasn't bad. What did they do? What? Disorderly conduct is what you're going to jail for. On July 12, 2023, officers received a report from a restaurant about a woman acting disorderly and hitting a man. The cops tried to understand the situation as the property owner wanted them to leave. But when the officer questioned the woman, she was ignoring them. I just don't need to. Uh, yeah. You guys want her trespass or something like that? Someone no. said that in the call? Yeah, that because she wouldn't leave, I guess. So okay. That, that, might, that was actually it. That okay. Happen. All right. All right. Okay. Do you have your ID on you? Yeah. Appreciate you. All right. Let's, let's calm down. It's just it's a little heated. That's all. She's got a lot on her plate. She has a lot on her plate. <laughs> Hello. Hey, do you mind talking with her? She's the female half. Supposedly they're just in there arguing, so she left and they want to trespass. More but I was, she's up there. Yeah, just a uh, just a uh, verbal. Okay. I'm just gonna get his real quick. Hi. What's going on? A little bit of an argument with the Mister. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. So are you not willing to give a statement about what's going on? Because that's we were called because of you. Okay. Well, I'm gonna need to ID you anyways. Yep. How long have you guys been together? Three years. Three years. Lived together and stuff? Yep. Both Holy been drinking? God, of course. I mean, if I, were, if I weren't at work, you know, I'd be enjoying the sun and the beach too, you know? So, I feel ya. Look at them. Including all the cooks. Thank you, b****. What, what? That's very Sit down. It's all good. She was sitting over here. Okay. Right. Okay. And she kept calling you for some reason. She kept calling you? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, she was store phone. Oh, okay. And she's laughing for some reason. I don't know what her relationship is. Right. I said, oh no, she's going to come over. That was Tad. And she showed up. Burrito. She could be in the head of him. Well, was, I got pretty pissed off and stood up and told her to get the f out of here. Right. Um, so did she. So hit him with the burrito and then hit me in the head. And, okay. Uh, yeah. All right. So you just wanted to go I don't away? Want to or? Charges. Okay. Yeah, I'm not. It was a burrito. Okay. I got mad at the scared the Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I lost my temper a little bit. No, yeah, nobody. There was no physical contact other than the burrito. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, Which, all yeah. right. So I don't, I don't know the relationship, but obviously they have a little smash. She seems a little. Like, yeah. Do you mind if I get your first name and your last name? Yeah, it's called. What's that? She does not want to ID herself in order to want to help Oh, gosh. Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back. Can I ask you a question? Uh, were you outraged? Kind of yeah, like, wow, what happened? Yeah. Right. You're kind of like, wow, leave. what just happened? She just threw something at me. This is crazy. No, I told me to get the Okay. Yeah. Okay. I got food all over me. Right, <laughs> right, right. Able to burrito. Okay. Know? So yeah, I definitely, definitely will scream it and touch her though. Right. No, 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 no. I'm just so uh, she's not being cooperative with us. Yeah. So I'm, I plan on arresting her on a disorderly. Well, she's disorderly. Yeah. Right. I, I don't want to. Press but I have to make sure. Yeah, I understand that part. Um, I mean, she hit me in the head with a burrito. You were kind of like, wow, what just happened? So I just got hit in the head with no, a burrito. No, I saw it. Yeah, I saw the whole thing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> First right. time in my life I've been hit in the head with a burrito. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, she was just out of control. She probably needs to cool off somewhere. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, she will. Thank you. After speaking with other employees, the police gathered enough information to arrest her and took the appropriate action. Turn around for me. What? Turn around for me. Nope, he has money back. Thank you very much. style for me just like this I go there you go
Perfect. Stay over there for Stay me. Stay over there. Do you mind search her for me? Thank you. Really, it wasn't bad, man. It wasn't bad. What did I do? What? Disorderly conduct is what you're going to jail for. What? I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. Okay. Her fix it right now. I can't fix it. I can't. I tried to. Why is he not getting arrested? Cool. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. We'll walk over to my car. Can you walk over with us? Okay, are you going to be a problem or are you going to walk? I'll walk. Thank I'll you. I can't pick him up. You threw him in the middle. So, Kurt, we're, we're going to walk across right. the street. I can't do nothing. I tried. I can't do nothing. I tried. I have no idea. I got no idea. Well, I tried. What, what is keep going, keep going, keep going. We'll, uh, we'll go to the right. I'm on the room. I didn't do a goddamn Mm -hmm. Alright, right on the other side of this top, or the Tacoma here. Put her on that uh, driver's side, actually. Yeah. Keep going a little bit more, you're not my driver's seat. A little bit more, right there, thank you, ma'am. Alright, go ahead and have a seat for me. Have a seat. Uh, my phone. Cause I got your phone right here. Alright. Have a seat. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate you. You want to? You want to? Yeah, disorderly conduct. Do you? Uh, do you want? Who do you? That? Do you want your stuff to go with you no, or with him? Ma'am, I'm asking you a question. Do you want your stuff to go with you or him? All right, it's gonna go with you. Well, I don't know. There might be more to it. Nah, He's the one that just was. Yeah. And Miss Me hit the guy next to me. Oh, no, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> I wanted some beers. Get over. Get over. Yeah. To make calls. But didn't you guys have a uh, an order again? Yeah. Didn't you have an order against her? Yeah. So you guys got that settled? Yeah. Okay. Dismissed. It was dismissed? Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, Carl. Uh, she's going to answer me what she wants to do with her property, so I can't release it to you. Um, she's going to go for misdemeanor disorder of the conduct. Uh, what? She threw a burrito at you and then it hit another person. Oh, there. God. Don't act. Don't come to a bar and act a fool. You're not going to go to jail. Okay. All right. That's it. Was That's it all. that big of a deal? He's pissed off. Uh, um, other people here are upset. All right, so... Was he uh, upset? Yeah. Yeah, he got hit in the head with a burrito. He's sitting there, his clothes are messed up. He's sitting there trying to enjoy some food. So, do you have any questions for me? All right, so... I gotta get her out tomorrow. Six out of five, it's a misdemeanor. It's a misdemeanor. I'm assuming you're getting to the six out of five. So, you are being arrested for disorderly conduct. Okay, the establishment and the victim... No. Um, nope. 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 What? No. No what? I was there. You were where? Kurt is. No. Kurt is not the victim. Kurt is oh, not the Kurt, victim. Please. Kurt is not the victim, ma'am. Who is the victim, please? I would love to know this one. It'll be on your affidavit. Come on, ma'am. Please. Look, you can't go to restaurants and throw burritos at people, <laughs> and it hit somebody else. I I agree. I do not disagree. I did not walk up to that to that call and say I want to arrest somebody for a misdemeanor charge that is ridiculous. The woman was charged with disorderly conduct. This irate elderly man got into a dispute with a restaurant waitress. See what unfolded afterward. I went over there and confronted him, and then things started flying everywhere. I, I didn't hit anybody. I did nothing. How'd you end up with that? On January 24th, 2024, officers responded to a Hooter restaurant in Florida regarding an assault in progress. The video recorded by the victim showed that during the altercation, the old man grabbed the woman and pushed her against the wall. Your information, man. So, Jay, you got that for me? 
No, I'm good. I know I said. I want him to get it. I'm getting ready to slap that phone out of the I wish you would. Oh, wait, 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 the wait, the wait, wait, the wait, 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 the wait, 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 Oh, you're, oh, you're going to jail. Oh, Fucking get that phone away. Oh, my God. What the What the What the he put his hands on me. He put his hands on me. No, they're going to jail. They're going to jail. No, y'all are all going to jail. No, y'all are all going to jail. When the cops arrived, he started investigating the incident and spoke with the victim. After hearing her story, she said she wanted to press charges against the suspect. I take it, did you see anything or do you know someone who might have seen something? Well, they all have the video of the dude smacking one of my servers and okay. getting smacked back. Where's that video at? I was recording Damn. it and they both hit the phone out of my hand and the guy in the green shirt, he actually attacked me and that's when they all, all the guys started fighting. The guy in the green shirt that took off from the black yes, truck? Yes, he put Cruz. his hands on me worse, but the, one of the guys out there put his hands on me too. Okay, I, have where? A, I have both of them on video. And then right this was the. Oh, your manager? Okay. Do we have cameras? Yes. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at that. He actually attacked me. Okay. Like, he grabbed me and pushed me against the wall by my neck, and that's when all the guys started fighting with I, got, I had two guys walking out. I asked if they saw anything. They said they did. They saw Parrothead, I guess, the guy in the tank top out there. I guess he put hands on someone, so I'm gonna go look at footage and see what happened. Hands on me. Yeah. On her. Both, both of the guys put their hands on me. Only on you. Video. I have it on video. Yes. Okay. Okay. Both of them. Yes, both of them. I have it on video, putting their hands on. Okay. All right. I was recording it just for everyone's safety. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're and good. they both attacked me. Okay. Of them. So I'm gonna go look at camera footage that way. I have like a bird's eye view of what happened in the right, Wikimedia's as well. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Thank you. Just for future, or like just for the safety of it, I appreciate you recording it. It makes it a lot easier. But I record everything for stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, The only reason I was doing it is because all the guys started fighting and stuff and arguing and so Was I anyone was else hit that you saw apart from you? No, when the guy in the green shirt hit me, I fell on the floor and so I missed everything. Everyone started like... When he charged at you? Yeah, he charged at me because everyone was over here arguing and he charged me because I was recording everything because he's not recording. I and then you. when I fell, I got up, everyone was just going at it. Like everyone was trying to break everyone up at that point. Okay, so you don't exactly saw who else could like got no, hit? No, 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 no. It was just the two guys that both attacked me were attacking every guy in here that was defending us. Okay. Like they were the ones starting everything. Okay. okay I'm sending it right now. I have videos of them getting in my manager's face too, I can send you. I'll send you this one too. I'll send you that one too. I'll send you all of them. This went on for about 45 minutes, and we just kept telling them to leave the whole time. It's looking like we might have PC from both individuals, the one up there in that tank top, and the one that took a 10-8, the one in the green. There's the one in the green there. actually hurt my hand when he pressed me against the wall. Yeah, the, the one in the green right definitely. Here, like, he attacked me. He attacked me first. If you want to show him that video, green. the one of him yeah, charging they both did. I want to press charges because they both yeah. attacked me. Yeah, I'm going to need your information as well. The suspect then provided his information, asserting that he hadn't hit anyone and trying to act like he was innocent. Um, we had problems with service. We started complaining, and the one server started running him out. We asked for the manager. He did nothing. Um, it just kind of escalated from there. The one girl kept running her mouth, you know, you pieces of shit, da, 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 you know, and, you know, we're not, 
I'm not a young guy. Okay. So we're just in there trying to have our board meeting. And, you know, the staff kept running their mouth. I went to this guy, the guy that was just out here, the heavy yeah. set guy with the ponytail. Okay. And I said, look, you know, what's going on? Da, 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 da. We're just trying to have our board meeting. Da, da, da. And he did nothing. And she just kept running her mouth. Okay. Um, so it just kind of escalated from there. There's a couple other employees yeah. that, that ran their mouth in there and stuff. And I went over there and confronted them. And then things started flying everywhere. I, I didn't hit anybody. I did nothing. How'd you end up with that? It's not, I don't think it's my hand. Uh, it may have been, well, I just, guess it is my hand. Yeah, yeah. But I didn't hit anybody. Yeah, yeah. So you know, I'm just asking how you ended up with it. Did you scrape it I don't it on know. Something? I don't know because it was like eight people jumping on me, including their waitresses and, and some guy with a pink hat and a dollar bill sticking out of it. And okay. So I don't know. I don't know how that happened. I thought it was, actually, I thought there was blood off my nose or something. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't somebody see hit me here. Yeah, yeah. I'm, so. I'm just going to take a look at your report. No, you're fine. So, um, it's a little blood on your nose, but I think it's from actually from that. Yeah. It's well, I, that. like I said, uh, I thought I thought the blood on my hand was from my nose. So. Okay. All right. Um, so. Okay. Well, I, dude, I, there's so many people here. I'm like, I'm confused. Okay, so, are the, all these people here with you? Um, she is. <laughs> yeah. She is. Um, Did y'all see what happened? A little bit, yeah. All right, like, hold, ahead, just, yeah, hang tight. Right, I'm here. I'm yeah, just no, stand right there for me. Hey, just, you're, you're, no, 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 y'all are good. Do y'all, like, see just them talking crap and stuff like that? And then, I, 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 hey, I saw him put his hand, put, hit that way just, yes. He? He did? Yeah, he, hey, yes, yes. Okay, like okay. This. All right, here, I'm just going to grab your information real quick. <laughs> Yeah. Did you see the same thing, sir? Yeah. Okay. Where were y'all? Just where were y'all sitting? Right. Right, one of them high tops right there. One of the high tops. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. And it happened like. Uh, I guess, the, the, kitchen I guess the entrance right to the kitchen. Okay. On, on right, right on the other side they of the bar. Off and they, they left and they come back in. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Uh, well, not. Uh, yeah. I don't know where the other one went. Okay. All right. But yeah. Yeah. It was, yeah. All right. Yeah, the one Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Up. If I need anything from me, I'll give you. I'll give you all a call. The cop tried to look for CCTV footage while noting the essential details, then interviewed another employee. You know what time more or less it was exactly that it happened? Well, this happened like, it happened stamp? on video, so yeah, it, it happened at 8.47. Oh, yeah, we were looking right around the right It started at like 8.45 probably. When individual in the green shirt kind of tackled you the way he did. Yeah, he pushed me against the wall, like, um, in the video. Can I get your pin so we can, like, resend a ticket? Yeah. I literally, but if I, take a picture I couldn't even see what he was doing when he was attacking me because I was like this, like, my head was turned away when he did it. Like, I'm not hurt or anything, but, like, I have evidence that, like, he did Anywhere something. Else? No, but the video, like, shows him running up, like... Do you have your driver's video, license on you? Uh, I don't have it on me, no. Okay, then what's your first name? Brianna, B-R-I-A-N-N-A. Uh -huh. Middle name? Okay. I was standing right here. No, I'll, I'll yeah, I got you. Alrighty. Okay. What's your name? Do you have ID on you? Or is it... Okay, it's fine. Alright. How do you spell your name? What exactly did you say? <laughs> I was the one who called. I was freaking out. Okay. So... You saw... Alright, just, to, to, just as far as everything, we know how the fights are, like the arguments and all that. As far as where it starts to get physical, that's kind of what I'm like hearing okay, towards. when I started getting physical, I was right here sitting right next to her. And then I'm, I was the one who had caught the phone. Yeah. So, he came in, smoked back there, and I picked it up, and then next, you know, gave it to her, and I was sitting right here, and then I turned, and he starts running going fast, so I was like, Okay, so he starts with the green shirt. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, running. sorry. Oh. He's like, I literally don't know where he came from, I turned my head, and he starts running towards her. Okay, then what, what happened? And then everyone started hopping. Did you see him make contact with her? He was trying to grab the phone, and like, Returning to the suspect, he kept insisting that the victim pulled her phone, and he pushed it away. Right in your face, just video and going, you're a b you're a b you're yeah. a bitch, you know, and it's just like, get the phone out of my face. Did anyone ever even, like, really talk to you about the guy that punched you? No, no I don't right, even know well, who 
well, so uh, he was the one that you, you pointed, pointed him out. Yeah, yeah, the guy in the white tee. Yeah, so, so we've already identified and everything, right? So what happened? I don't know. He, because well, he here's heckler. the deal. He was a heckler. He was sitting at the bar. And, and I guess, I mean, let's face it. You're a guy. Somebody's given a, you know, getting into an altercation with yeah. a, a Hooters waitress. You try to come to her defense. That's probably what happened with him. Yeah. I don't know for sure. But I... He was but very yeah, verbal and abusive. Oh, yeah, he was yelling For stuff the across the restaurant. Hour, so, yeah. minutes, so it did it seem like he was protecting her, or did it seem like no, it was no, it was, no. it was more for he, her? He came up, you know, like in my face and stuff. And I went, come on, man, anytime you want. And, and I, I, you know. You didn't think the, literally. It was, yeah, I didn't think anything was ever going to happen. <laughs> so. He came up the same way out and walked out to my room. Charlie no, you're good. Those lights are very uh, bright. But yeah, it was very you know, I, I didn't yeah, it I wasn't anybody. Fight. I mean, Hang on, Yeah, he had absolutely nothing to do with us saying we'd like to see a manager because and, and, our food is and I'll cold. be honest with you, I'm, coming I'm, out, I'm a manager going you know. Yes, sir. If this manager, this guy with the ponytail, yeah. would have dealt with things from That's the beginning, the lack of service, the mouthing off of his employees, when I got this one. nothing would have ever come to him. But he allowed him to do it, and I went, and I was and I went, 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 I need your information, her information, and he wouldn't even give it to me. He kept saying, I'll get it for you, and he never brought it back. While she's sitting over at the bench, and and we're sitting over here, and she's yeah. We have, we have like twenty of us had a. Us. We're having a board meeting. Yeah. You know, for a nonprofit, like, and and she's over there just like videotaping us and running our, our like mouth if, and stuff. If the manager like, was on. any kind of manager at all, he would have said, "You need to leave this yeah. area." Yeah. Get out go. of here. Go on. Go in the back. Whatever you got to do to get out of this situation. Let me ask another question real quick because common sense, but not everyone uses it, right? Has I know I got your information, your information, your information. Has we got? Have so we got your? Yeah, yeah. yeah, they've yeah. got everybody's Wonderful. information. Wonderful, yeah. perfect. Yeah. I'm just making sure because we're gonna need everyone's. Yeah. 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 Um. Yeah, was, I just want to go was, home. I've been since 7:30 this morning. I know. Uh, hopefully we get this done pretty yeah. soon. Yeah. But like I said, the cameras in there are giving us issues. So. Yeah. It, it was yeah. just stupid. It should have never escalated to yeah. the point that. No, I agree. It did. And, and when she tried to videotape us, I went up to put my hand in front of her phone so she didn't videotape us, and then like. I don't know people who jumped, jumped on my on back. Oh, jump on your back? Yeah, people yeah, jumped, jumped on me on because I went to block her phone. Yeah. Cause That's I said, all I did. I said, stop taping us because she just, I mean, she literally had her phone right here. She and was I said, literally stop doing it. one of these type of things. Like, yeah. Stop. And I, I yeah. went to reach out and block her phone. And all of a sudden, and again, I think it goes back to it was a female and, and I was a guy. And they thought I was going to hit her or whatever. whatever. But I did nothing to her. I never touched her. I never did anything to her. I'm just trying to get I'm, I'm, out of there. And then they jump on my back. And literally, you know, I'm not a small guy. So I just kind of braced myself like this and just stood there with these guys on my back. And that's all I did. Yes, I, had to pick up I don't even know when somebody, somebody knocked Yeah, somebody knocked my glasses off and then they grabbed me from behind. So did, you, did, did, did you? Did you? Yeah, yeah, that's a good, good move. <laughs> uh, that's a good move. A lot of people step on them. That's, that's a good one. Um, did you have any markings or anything from when you got hit? When you got hit? They, they said I got a, a, a mark on my left. Is it my lower one? Oh, yeah. Did someone get a picture of it? Or anything? I don't know. No, not yet. I'm going to do that real quick. If you don't mind. No, not at all. Like I said, I, I, I didn't come here looking for... Now, let me ask you this, too. Um, do you want to be a victim of battery if we do go ahead and develop probable cause for him? It depends on who does it. No, I mean... No, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know who hit me. I saw who hit me. That's was, why I came running back. The guy in the, with the white shirt yeah. and the stuff. Mm. Just a mouth. Man, yeah. 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 And, I, and I mean, honestly, if it was anybody, I, I'd probably want to press charges against him. But uh, again, you know, I'm not looking for anything. I mean, it was... The Kellen is 26. I don't know his situation. I don't know anything yeah. else. Um, and the game just Yeah. Yeah, well, he doesn't work here. Um, yeah, I know. He was sitting down at the... Oh, the man. Okay, I'll let it 26. You know, it's like half of our food never even came out. I mean, it took forever for us to even get... I mean, we, we weren't in there so long because I'm sitting there begging for the bill. Can we please get our bill? Well, he has to take he has to take stuff off your bill. I'm like, what's he have to take off? Oh, ah, take it out of the window. that we never received. Well, I hope he takes them off. Well, thank you very much. But, come on. I hey, just, just outside. Yeah. I understand that 
you know, be with someone recording that way or someone right. trash right. talking might get on your nerves to the point where you feel like you have to do something. But still, you putting your hands on someone or you putting your hands I on someone's I property. I put my hands. I never touched her phone. I reached out for it, but I never touched her phone. I mean, I it never dropped. touched her. I don't know if she dropped it or not. Yeah. I never. I, all I know is I reached up to block it, and I had Next several thing people you see jump on, on my back. Yeah. Next thing you see on footage, the phone's on the floor, though. Well, and then, I don't and know. Who, the whole thing I don't know true. why. You, I didn't hit it out of her hand. I never touched it. I never actually came in contact with the phone. I never came in contact with her. I mean, you you see it on the footage. That's why I'm being. Well, that's fine. We'll go in and watch the footage now because I never came in contact with her. So I reached up to block it. And that was it, whether she went went to pull back and dropped it or what, I don't know. Based on the probable cause, the man was detained. Unfortunately, it is on footage you doing so, and we have, con like, we have witnesses. Touching her or the phone? Yes. And we no, have you don't. Yes, no, you we don't. Do. We do, um, and we also have witnesses claiming that they did see you. They, they may have seen me reach up to, to block it, and I'm not saying I didn't do that, I did. Okay, well, but I never, regardless of the specifics of what you may or may not remember, I understand no, the no, situation, but based on what we have, we have to work on what we have. Okay. okay. We have a job to do. All right. Okay. All right. So as of right now, based on everything and based on the totality of the circumstances I've seen, um, we do have probable cause to place you under arrest for assault for the waitress. Okay? So that's where we're at. Okay. I'm just going to, it's battery. If she wants to press charges and based on what we have, it's enough to put you. And I can pr press cost. charges against the others that were involved with me, right? Here you go, Mark. Would you not rather take that to the jail with you? Yeah. Well, anything you want, you can take to the jail with you. No, I don't. I, I mean, honestly, I didn't see that. Yeah, my, my keys, I'm being arrested, man. Suppose I hit her. No, you so, didn't hit her. I know that. You, yeah, got, you know that. I need you to place your hand on your back. Okay. You want to get yourself to work first? Huh? You want to get yourself to work first? Yeah. Whatever you, yeah. whatever you want to take with you, you can. I mean, I appreciate you working with us, okay? Like this to block I know that. You got pushed into her. I know that. The idiot's behind. I know that. You know that. You got and pushed into her. Find that out. So, what's yeah. the deal now? I've never been arrested before in my 61 years. Okay, well, it, it's going to It's just simple battery. Um, so, you'll have the bond. So, I mean, you've never been arrested, you'll have a quick bond. No, I've never been arrested in my life. Okay, I'm so it'll be, a, years old. it'll be a bond, and you can bond out before first appearance. You can, you can get Which out. Which is when? It will be in the morning. I'm filling out paperwork you, all right? The man was charged with simple battery. Disregarding police warnings have its consequences. See how this woman quickly learned the price for ignoring their orders. I'm not resisting. Yeah. I wasn't even disorderly. You told me to get off the property. No, listen, y'all told me to get off the property. No, on February 11th, 2024, the police were called to a disturbance involving a woman who was refusing to leave the business despite repeated requests in Florida. When the officer found out that the suspect was no longer welcome, they instructed her to leave. She initially questioned the order, causing a delay. Hello. Hi, we, we got a call? Uh, no, someone called us. Oh, okay. Can I Uh, I guess so, yeah. Hi, I'm not cutting you, they called. Oh, hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. This gentleman's finger is You gotta go. It's a private business. If they want, they can refuse service to anybody they want. It's a private business. They can re there's not. If you don't leave, you're gonna go to jail. No, listen, listen. I'm not gonna listen. We can talk outside if you want. Listen, outside. Has her kid here. If you then make a complaint to McDonald's, okay, you, you have to leave. She's sitting here telling me I gotta go, but she literally has her kids sitting. Make a complaint to McDonald's. Well, that's, that's, all right, that's DCF. Then call DCF. <laughs> you like, call DCF. The so fuck? It's not us. <laughs> Are you going or no? Can I wrap up my chocolate or? Yeah, I'd like you to hurry up. <laughs> I mean, I'm leaving, so I mean. I don't know. She's doing too much. Not now. Her uh, kids in the back. Call McDonald's again, has nothing to do with us. Call McDonald's corporate. Back. Call corporate. Okay, her kids in the back. Call corporate. In the cooking area. Call corporate. She didn't. Now she don't want them, y'all to see that her kids in here. Yeah. Call corporate. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to get the corporate's number before I leave, so. I can politely tell that manager to come back over here since so she got. You go, you can go outside. Okay. 
Yeah, you're being difficult. I'm Sunday. Not, yeah, 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 you are. Being yeah, you are. Because I'm sitting here with business and I'm being harassed. Harassed by the manager that came over here that also had her kids sitting here. With you. She's a she just printed, she just printed that out. She just printed that out put it up here before y'all pulled up here. So, I'm a pan Want to make it official? You can't come back here for a year, or do you just want to leave now? Call today. I'm and... just saying. You realize? Y'all realize she's doing too much, yeah. right? That's right. Do you realize you're barking up the wrong tree? We don't know, and quite frankly, we don't care. They call us, told they want something all out of our business. Don't we care. just do. I mean, I don't care. All right. So why are we still talking? Go around McDonald's. What? If you, you have to leave the property, I'm gonna have to take your handcuffs and leave you the property. I'm out of McDonald's. Like, what's your name? Property. Like, you gotta leave the parking lot of McDonald's. It's hard to understand. The way you explain it, yeah. To See the parking lot? To leave the property? Off the property. Yeah, Off. Explain it, yeah. After several warnings, the woman did not leave the property and quickly faced legal consequences. Yes, listen. We're done with this. So either leave the property, I'm going to put handcuffs, you're going to gun clubs. I'm coming to pick you up right now. What? I already told you, you're supposed to leave. Y'all said off the property. Look. Yeah, and where did I say whoa, the whoa, property whoa. was? Wait, 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 Turn around. I'm not, I was asking y'all the Babe, come get me. Babe. What the dude? What the How are y'all gonna arrest me when I'm at the same Because fuck? you're told to leave the property. I'm off and the you don't property. wanna leave. Look! Yeah. Let's go now. Now we're going My to jail. Phone. We'll grab it. Same I'm asking y'all the question. What the f are the cops here for me for? Property, y'all ain't even trying to talk. Uh, what the I, I wasn't trying to be a smart. No, because I'm wasn't trying to be a this is religious speech. You can't take it off. Yeah, they have That's to. That's religious. Off. It's religious, it bro. It's religious. It it's work. religious. Listen, you're already catching a charge after charge after charge. Charge for what? I was asking y'all the question. I'm not what resisting. Disorderly I'm, conduct. I'm not resisting. Yeah. I wasn't even disorderly. I, you told me to get off the property. Shh. No, listen, y'all told me to get off the property. I'm not listening. What's wrong with people walking without shoes? I don't know. So he's going to jail. Why? Uh, he was refusing to leave. Oh, um, really? So you asked him how many times? Oh, like four or five? He refused to leave. He refused to I leave. Gave him, I gave him, I gave him time. I gave him time. Yeah. He didn't say, well, you don't have a sign. I'm like, okay, let me post my sign. I was supposed to post a sign, so I post a sign. And... So you asked him four or five times to leave. He refused to leave. We came. He eventually got up, but then didn't want to leave the parking lot. We said, you have to leave the premise, or you're going to get trespassed. He said, you refused to leave, so he's going to jail for trespass. Um, do you have a question for me? If he comes back within a year, call us, he gets arrested for a trespass okay. again. Awesome. Um, could you just raise your right hand for me? Do you swear upon that the information telling me the truth? It is the truth. Okay. The woman was charged with resisting without violence and trespass. Witness the surprising moment when a seemingly small decision by this employee escalated into a major legal issue. Yeah, and it's this, and it's, I don't have a drug test to like next one. This is, and I have not smoked since I've been out of jail. Come on. How long were you in jail? Four months. On June 25th, 2021, officers responded to a report about a restaurant worker who was caught on camera smoking marijuana in Florida. The restaurant workers were unaware of the report, so the cop contacted the caller to follow up. Someone called about Kiara. Kiara? Yeah, hey, what's up? Hello. How you doing? 
Someone called us. The other car, let's see where I can play with this. Someone called about you, I don't know. Somebody called you about what? They're about to go check, he's about to go check the car, see who called us real quick. About me? I don't know. <laughs> Hold on. No, we got the right bird. Hello? Hello, this is Officer Ferguson with the Ocala Police Department. Hey, how you doing, sir? Pretty good. Um, where, what's, going wh on? what's going on? We're, uh, we're here. Yeah, I told this one. Break room, rolling up marijuana. How did you get that information? One of the other employees sent the video. Who who sent it? A guy named Colton. He's a, he should be there now. He should, he's an employee there now. Okay. Colton and Gavin. Are you not here? Yeah. Where are you at? I'm at my house. I'm the director. They, the manager called me. Okay. The, um, the store manager called me and said, hey, I just got a video of Kiara rolling up marijuana in a break room. Nice. Just I'm like, you. okay. Okay. Alrighty. Well, uh, we'll try All to right. figure it out. So, um, we're gonna, is there any kind of manager here? Yeah, it's a manager. Her name is America. Okay. All right, we'll figure it out. Thank you. The police approached Kiara to discuss his concerns, but she quickly became emotional because of her probation status. Well, he's got a video that says he has a video of you in the break room rolling up. So that's what he said he has, yeah. That's why we're here. Are you, I mean, I have a pack of guns. Sorry, I'm gonna let go. You can. Search your bag or I mean, okay. well, so we gotta call that there's a your hand is out of it. your right hand. I don't. What you doing on probation doing that? Look, don't 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 settle this hand it to me and let's go. Look, look, I'm not about to cuff you up right now. Please. We're gonna go, we're gonna talk outside of your business, but I don't want this on you inside your work to give it to me real quick. Alright? Let's just go talk outside. We're gonna figure this out. Chill out. Hey, chill out. Okay. Okay? What are you on probation for? Huh? Grand Theft Auto. Grand Theft Auto? You'll get a bag real quick for me? A bag? So, yeah. Good night, seven. You got your ID on you in there? Yeah. At work? I'm not even smoking at work, to be honest. But why are you rolling up at work? Come on now. Dodge your hair? Yeah, it's going on like 16. Alright, so what's up? Yeah, Yeah, for Grand Theft, right? Yes, sir. So, I get here to say what we got the call for, asked her for permission to search her bag. She said yes. I see her try to put this around her bag, so that's where we're at. But I told her I wasn't going to cause any drama inside her work or anything like that, so that's why I just brought her out here, and that's where we're at now. Um, I wouldn't mind taking it if you don't. 
if you were busy or something, you get calls you on it. Oh, Huh? I'm not sure yet. Pegerton. Go on three, you're running real quick. You can run Pegerton as well. There is going to be signals to and see. We got to test vehicle. that stuff. Why don't you need to call vehicle? You can sit in the car while you do that. I know it's raining. Yeah. So, why, why were you doing this at work? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
50 copy Florida Tech. Who was driving? <laughs> Who was driving? <laughs> Alpha Zulu 04 Alpha Foxtrot AZ 04 AF on a black Hyundai Tuscan. Signal 14 year airbag deployment and damage to the right shoe island bistro if we could find a responsible for that. Stand by. Say he doesn't need a restaurant. Is he on the phone? No, 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 no. I'm not on the phone at all. No hands in my pocket. You don't? No, no, you don't. You're all right. You got me in the attic or anything? No. Is this your car, Hunter, or is it a rental? It's a rental? Okay. Did anybody see what happened? Yeah, we all they did. We, uh, we I wasn't here. Yeah, I heard the crash. I called you. So, okay. do you need to know like, what happened? I guess. That'd be great. Um, so we were standing over there. At the intersection. They took a they took a right turn. I mean, and, uh, probably speeding okay. over the limit. Okay. And then it looked like a jerk because it was like it was like someone maybe someone was like maybe jerking the wheel maybe. Uh -huh. But it was like very fast movement. So I it, I would find it hard to believe that he was going like this. You know what I mean? But okay. he he hit this curb right here. Okay. And he landed there, and so I, that's just I mean I would guess that someone. Was I'm coming to own the place right now. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Thank you. The people so that own the place they're in Chicago at Jen's. That's yeah. good. See, the yeah. guy that owned the building asked me. All right, all right, honey. Thank you. I'm trying to talk to him. Thank you. Hang on, give me up just a minute. Gotcha. How old are you? I'm hey. six years old. Okay. Are you dad? I'm, I'm the dad. Okay. Yeah. Were you with him? No, no, no. no. It was just me. We were just these. Yes. How old are you? I'm uh, 18. Okay. Did you see who was driving? Um, no. We, we just saw. It looked like somebody was okay. getting Okay, we don't need her. We need I d No, no. Okay. I, d I didn't Thank see it. No, we didn't. Like we didn't specifically see it. Why do you see that? I don't know. When I saw the turn, I saw it. Yeah. Yeah, well, like, uh, yeah it definitely. Like, like, when they got out of the car before anyone got here, he was pissed. He was not happy. He was already upset. Okay. But you didn't see who got out of what seat? No, ma'am. No. We were all in the room. Yeah. Okay. We just saw At the actual intersection? Yes, yes, ma'am. We couldn't see who got out. Three people down here. But it was, yeah. They yeah. might have saw who got out, but we, we, just, we saw the, the turn and the, the crash. Phelps was intoxicated and had a hard time understanding his words. He also struggled to follow instructions and was argumentative with the officers. Yeah, I, I know. Bro, so if he got my ID, he got my, got my credit card. I, I promise you, he didn't, squat, he didn't swipe nothing with me turn my head this way for no reason, bro. He got my ID and my credit card. Okay. So I know it's got on camera, ID. so I ain't really tripping. But then again, I can lock it right here, right now. But then again, he got my bro. But he didn't take it out of your pockets. What you mean? I ain't going in my pocket myself and then do this. No. I didn't hand it to y'all. I'm following right now. Now you got right me now, now you got but... confused, though, because you told us to get it out of your center console. That's where we found your ID. Now you're that's me where me. my that's not where my credit. You talking about my ID? Your you're ID not talking about my it. credit card. I don't know where your credit card. It was in my pocket. Oh, I, I didn't grab it. She didn't grab it, so I don't know where. So what you're saying is you're missing your credit card? My credit card in there. I promise. In the, in the car. My credit okay. card and my ID is in there. Okay. What? Well, I promise. What's her name? Lonnie Phelps. Lonnie. L. As a lion, mm -hmm. O N N I E. Lonnie. Belt, as okay. Mike okay. Belt, the white one. So I talked to the EMS and they said that you're not really answering their questions. So they got to make sure you're okay. But so yeah, what's going on? What's going to happen, bro? Just go ahead and get through all see how this going to go, bro. Hey, y'all ain't, she ain't listen to me. You ain't listen to me. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. I know you got to do your job. So what you got to do? Mr. Phelps, we got to do I know you got to do your job. So what you got to do, bro? We got to do a investigation. All right. So what's that? So we're gonna do a report as to why the car is in the building. Okay. All right. You said you have insurance on it because of the insurance company. It's, it's one of those things. Cool. We're gonna give you a driver's exchange of information. Okay, if we can get me on the sidewalk. Y'all didn't have to get in the car one time talking to me. You wanna hop up on the sidewalk? I don't want to, cause y'all gonna make me get off balance or try to make me get off balance. No, no, she's to gonna... I'm just standing still. My hands behind my back. 
guys. You're good, bro. Who are y'all falling now, bro? Do I? Well, get your sweet ass on in. Do you know him? I don't know that name. Put your phone now. What you looking for? Well, unfortunately, we're in public, so people can take pictures. Y'all got body cams on for a reason. Yeah. Yeah. All night long. Hear me, Danny. Phone, you like I said. Yeah. 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 Over where? Can you please get in front of me like you were you just was at your okay. car? We're changing the location. We're going to this car. Right I got up on me. Just trying to get it the best place. Bro, move line. me, bro. I don't work with you the whole time. Yeah, move me then, bro. I'm not going to move you. Oh, I just want oh, to move you. I At one point, Phelps lost his temper, and the officer had to detain him. His girlfriend was scared and crying, so the officer tried to comfort her and assured her. How are you going to tell me to demonstrate something that you can't do for me? I don't get it. Okay, I'm going to get you home. We'll get you home. Okay, we'll get you home. All right. It's okay. Do you know which hotel you're staying at today? Yeah. Are you supposed to go back? Okay. Just let me know. Yeah. My name's Katie. Okay. Break it tight. Stop it. Oh my gosh. Squeeze. 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 You need to comply right now. Comply right now. No. Because I don't, what I don't is think doing? Good enough to get into. She wants her phone. Uh, I, the fire guys can probably get in here. I mean, it's. Do you know where it is? You're the on phone? the passenger side, right? Yeah. Uh, 
I don't know where it is. I tried to look for it. It's okay. We'll find it. We'll find it. And I'm, and I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be that bitch That's okay. to you. I just, I the problem so is... I felt so bad when you walked away. I was okay. like... <laughs> I've, I've had worse said. <laughs> Gentlemen. Okay. All right. Thank you. Uh, the reason we don't want people on the phone is I don't know who you're talking to. I don't know if you're local. I don't know if you have people here that are going to come just, in yeah. and cause a bigger scene. It's for our safety, okay? And, and in the end, it's also for you. I just, like, you're frustrated. needed my parents for support. Okay. And it's frustrating. And mm -hmm. he's not acting the way he normally acts. Right. And, like, They're the only people I have to call. Okay. All right. Are they in town? Are they up no. there? No. <laughs> okay. Are you guys staying? Yeah, I mean, I have a place to stay. Okay, I'm good. After calming down Phelps' girlfriend, the police spoke with her to learn more about Phelps. Do you have an ID on you? Here. Yeah. No way I can just record it real quick. And did you know if everything was out of the car? Because I assume we're probably not. For the most part, it, it didn't. It didn't look like much. There was a uh, Amazon remote in there. Oh yeah, um, we probably need that. Okay. <laughs> is there luggage or anything in there, or is that at the? Yeah, I haven't checked the back. So. But that's probably all that was in there. Okay. This was like the second time we were there. Okay. Okay. Do you, I'm gonna call Dad. something. I mean, how am I gonna, like, get him out? He can call you. Real, can real call quick, him. let me get your phone number. Uh, the report. So, once booked in, do you want, is that his phone I take it, the one you've been on? Mm -hmm. Do you want him to take it with you so he can get his numbers out of it? Does he know your phone number by heart? I mean, yeah, you sure. Okay. Um, if he knows it, then we'll leave the phone with him, or with you. Um, and then, his phone with me? Yeah, unless you want or him to take it, that way you can get his number. He doesn't, if it's on the side, there's no chargers up there, so it's... Yeah, it's about to die, it's one. So, I mean, And on the other side of things... Let's stare at this way. You know. Alright, I'll put this with this stuff. Uh, that way he has your phone number, okay? Um, at this point, he's going to have to see a judge, okay? So he won't get out tonight, um, but you'll have more information tomorrow. So, I don't, that'll be up to county, okay? So we don't house them in our own jail. There's no county jail. So Generally, if they're cooperative yeah. and they get them through, like, the booking process, which is, like, fingerprints, picture. If they're what? Sorry. Cooperative. If they're cooperative, yeah. <laughs> Uh, they will let him use the phone, but if he's acting a fool, it'll probably be a while. It'll yep. probably be the morning before he'll use the phone. So, he'll go to first appearance, the judge will set a bond, and then they'll be able to go from there, okay? Well, I mean, I would keep both phones, if I can talk, charged. That way, if he somehow doesn't get your phone this, number, okay. he can call his phone and see who has it and you can answer it. All right. On the other side of this, though, like, this, this is a jury trial. This is all I'm I hear it right now, so I feel like it's probably gonna be a while. Not it's yeah. <laughs> I just wish I could talk to it right now. Yeah, I, I just want to ask a question, and there's no criminal charges, but no nothing. Has yeah. he done anything else besides alcohol tonight? No. That you know of? Mm -hmm. Hasn't smoked weed, hasn't mm -hmm. done things out of the ordinary, mm -hmm. hasn't drank. Like the reason I ask is I'm 
truthfully know. Like, no. You you would know him better right. than we do, and for more than one reason, I would want them to know, especially if he has hard narcotics. <laughs> No. It's just alcohol. It is what it is at this point. You know, get back to your hotel. Um, how do you want to get back to your hotel? You want Uber? I can, if you know where it is or which one it is, I can, and it's in town, I can give you a ride. Yeah. You would have to sit in the <laughs> yeah. back seat. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we're good. But we're not, I'm, just, I'm not going to leave a female out here. Yeah. I don't care what. <laughs> Phelps was charged with DUI and property damage. Don't miss out on thrilling stories about criminals. Subscribe to the channel for all the action.